so you started own cloud and then at some point something happened and I don't know what it was you're going to tell us and then next cloud came about so maybe first mm -hmm. explain what why the shift why did you go from own cloud to next cloud are they the same thing are they how are they related yeah yeah excellent question so um as you mentioned i i started the own cloud project six and a half years ago long time now and the idea is it was started as a pure open source project so open source and free software project um which, well, at the beginning, I basically the first version alone, and then more contributors came in, and they grew, the community grew, the user base grew, the product, the software grew, and um, really in a very nice open source uh, way and open source fashion. And then uh, one and a half years later, I basically, um, I, I got in contact with my, uh, my two uh, co-founders, um, and we discussed um, the, the, the option to create a company around it, and then we founded... Uh, own Cloud Inc. Um, at a time, um, company based in the U.S. and the idea was to basically sell an enterprise version of Own Cloud um, to uh, to companies, to big big corporations, big organizations, universities, and so on. Um, yeah, and this was like uh, was really successful for 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 some time. So Own Cloud at a time we were able to hire some of the people from the community. Um, and um, yeah, basically bring this product, bring the software and everything to the next level. Um, and my idea was always to basically try to do some kind of experiment or basically try to do something which is an open source project, an open source community and a company both at the same time and to have a nice, nice balance. So it's a win-win situation for both sides. And this was worked quite well for some time. But after a while, it basically it's no longer was basically in the, the 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 balance wasn't that good anymore. I think, and this was not only what I um, my impression, but also the impression from lots of the community people because this was special because I think we employed like I don't know like twenty developers at a time. Um, but of course, the, the, the community, the open source contributor community was, I think we reached like a thousand contributors at a time. So it was really a combination of full-time people paid to do the work and also people from the outside who contributed to it. And I, I just thought, and this was also the impression of most of the core developers too, that the balance wasn't that, that good anymore. And there were some other things like different ideas how to, how to, move forward with our investors and our management and basically um, the original idea to have like both in balance it wasn't really that it wasn't working out that well anymore and at some point um, we reached the, 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 the consensus basically most of the core people and community people that I would talk to and, and myself that we basically um, want to do improve a few things and we basically then, yeah, did the fork um, to Nextcloud. And Nextcloud, again, is, a, is an open source project and, uh, and also a company. Um, so it just didn't change. But I think the balance is, is better this time. So we basically do this now to, to, as a reboot to reach the next level of this. Okay. 